and here we're showing the mechanism of conversion of cyclohexene to adipic acid using potassium permanganate. Some reactions under acidic conditions, my um, manganese reagent is going to be the protonated form of the permanganate anion with an OH here instead of an alignment. So first stage is oxidative cleavage. This starts off with a cycle addition where the carbon-carbon double bond reacts with this pair of manganese oxygen double bonds to form a five-member ring. And the result of that is the double bond between carbons and cyclohexene gets converted to a single bond. And carbon-oxygen bonds are formed on each of these carbons at the top and bottom. And after the cycle addition, this carbon carbon bond gets broken again. And if we follow the the, the curved arrows, what happens is the pair of electrons in this carbon carbon bond is used to make a double bond to the top oxygen. And we break the bond that connects the manganese to that oxygen and use a pair of electrons in the bottom manganese oxygen bond to convert this other carbon oxygen bond into a double bond. So this is oxidative cleavage. Cleavage because the double bond between the carbons gets completely destroyed. And oxidative because we've created to each carbon a pair of carbon oxygen bonds. So oxygen pulls electrons away from carbon towards itself. The carbons become more positive, therefore oxidized. Okay, this produces a pair of aldides, but adipic acid has a pair of carboxylic acids. So there's a second stage. Aldides, in the presence of um, an oxidizing agent like permanganate, get further oxidized. And so here, this middle mechanism may be a little bit simplified compared to what's really going on, but it, 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 it covers the gist of what's happening. So if we start off with this protonated form of permanganate, we can use that as an acid to print at the oxygen of the aldehyde. That makes it more reactive towards nucleophilic attack. And then the minus charge that we put on this oxygen makes that oxygen a better nucleophile. So after the protonation step, nucleophilic attack of its own minus on the carbon that's doubly bonded to a positive charged oxygen makes an oxygen carbon bond. And then break the pi bond at the same time getting rid of the positive charge. Um, and we have a single bond to an OH. And that sets the stage to, to get back the double bond that we need to make this a carboxylic acid. So we describe this as a pair of electrons from a, a manganese oxygen double bond, makes an OH bond, we use the pair of electrons from the CH bond to make a double bond to this oxygen, the one that's not an OH. And then we break the bond that connects manganese to this oxygen. So you've got a carbonyl, you've got a carboxylic acid. So the dialdide intermediate, by the mechanism shown in the middle, each of these aldides become carboxylic acids, and we have a dipic acid.